God, I can't get over how drastically tilted and uplifted all these limestone bedding layers have been. The entire mountain range is just anticlines and synclines. And the region of the Sierra Madre Oriental is pretty tectonically not active now, but you could tell it went through intense compressional stress at some point. It's like someone took a fucking rug on a hardwood floor and just bunched it up accordion style. Look at that. All these layers, of course, were laid down horizontally originally in an ancient ocean. And then fucking boom, tilted up just like that. And again, so these, these bedding planes have been flipped up 90 degrees. This is typical of this whole mountain range because, again, it's just a bunch of anticlines and synclines that have, you know, like someone folded up or accordion the... Uh, a rug on a hardwood floor and that's in the, between those bedding planes and those cracks is what creates the microhabitat for all this shit to grow all the lechuguillas all the agaves all the hectias the tree like legumes look at there you got a fucking tree coming out of oh looks like a pine it's agave agave victoria regini ain't that nice only growing higher up right on the walls maybe because it's been poached who knows Heck the, uh, nice mam. I wonder what mammillaria that is. Look at all the trichomes. Isn't that nice? You cut a flower in two. It's, it's so cool that this, you're actually looking down at what used to be an ancient seabed. It's just cal calcareous muck. Calcium carbonate muck. It's been uplifted 90 degrees. And of course, up there you got more agave victoria regina. Regina. No idea what this is. What I forget what family. Someone told me. Rutaceae. No, this isn't a one of these is in Salicaceae. Oh here is a Tacoma stands. Look at that. 